Uh, sorry for my brief absence. I've had some big days on the bike and minimal days on the YouTube. So anyway, this video is obviously all about Josh Tarling and how the big man is outrageously strong. So this actually, I think, was written some time ago, to be honest. Um, but I saw it recently and I thought, you know what, let's let's cop a video out. So anyway, this is basically, actually it was only, it was only published a day ago. This is all about how he won um, junior men's time trial champs. So anyway, he goes on about his history um, he did a lot of hours, classic, classic, um, his height is six foot four, age 18, his weight on, tra on, what's it called, pro cycling stats says 88 kilos, apparently it's not, um, but his threshold, well, we can work out this, so, so we'll, we'll get onto that in a minute, so anyway, he is he a time trial specialist, yes, sort of, but anyway, let's get on to his, on to his training, so he had an easy day, um, so I had a recovery ride in the morning and two hours zone two, uh, on the T on, uh, just in the afternoon. So two hours in total, pretty chill. Fair enough. Not the biggest recovery ride I've ever seen an hour and a half at zone two, but fair enough. Um, then this was some zone three efforts. Again, doesn't look too hard. Two and a half hours with two blocks of 10 minutes of zone three. I guess they're junior though. So fair enough. Normalized 252 and he was at the top of zone three. Now, what we're going to do here is assume that it's Andrew Coggins' uh, zone two, um, sorry, zones, uh, and then we'll, we'll be able to figure out this. So we'll assume it's this. So zone three is realistically maybe, oh, no, that's wrong. Um, people normally say it's like 85%, more or less. Uh, I don't know why this is all being so annoying. Uh, this could be more of it. Yeah, so people say, oh, okay, we'll, we'll say maybe 90%. Um, so let's say it's 90%, 360 divided by 0.9, uh, which is out of 36 watts. So his threshold's around 400, more or less. Now, I think that's wrong. I reckon it's more like 85%, um, which would then give him a more realistic threshold of 420, which sounds more right, because we'll see in a minute why I think it's high, a little bit higher. Um, anyway, because that was the top of zone three, but not necessarily, you know, um, the, the highest part. Anyway, this is some endurance ride. Uh, but then he did a TT. Now, he did normalize the 470 for 24 minutes. That is a lot. That is a lot. 470 watts. It doesn't really matter how heavy you are. 470 watts and 18. Bonkers. So, yeah. That, you know, if you'd whack that in the calculation, 470, let's say, you know, uh, times by 95%. You know, it's not 100% accurate. You give him a threshold of 440. But, you know, that is big, his threshold, that's for sure. And if he's 80-something kilos, that's still 5.5 hospital kilo threshold, which is always good. Um, then he just does an endurance ride, which, again, is pretty standard. Uh, long out, long ride with zone 3 effort. So, again, 4 hours, mostly zone 2 with 2 blocks of 30 minutes. That's sounding more like it. 350 watts, that's probably not too too hard for him. And then, again, sun, uh, Saturday, long ride with some pyramid efforts. Um, but what's really amazing is actually at the end of the week. So after all this week, which I think seems pretty hard and he hasn't really had any days off, cracks out th uh, um, these ridiculous sessions. So it was basically like, um, oh, sorry. So in the evening on Monday, what he did was he then did uh, race pace intervals, which was, yeah, 500 watts for three minutes. That's pretty big. Like three minutes race pace with four, minute, four and a half minutes in between at 500 watts. That is a lot. And like the day before was hard and the day previously was quite hard. Um, I guess Thursday was a rest day. So he just has like three day blocks. Um, but yeah, pretty tough day out. Anyway, so Josh Tarling is a tank uh, doing intervals at 500 watts. is pretty strong no matter who you are. Um, doing 470 for 23 minutes is also bonkers. But anyway, cheers for watching. Hope you did enjoy it. I'll see you in the next one.